Well, now to an update on a scandal that made national headlines. The two Ohio fishermen who pleaded guilty to cheating in a walleye fishing competition last year, they have now been sentenced. You may remember these men admitted to hiding weights inside the fish. As Jack Shea from our Cleveland affiliate reports, the judge reeled it in when it came to sentencing. A judge here in Cleveland ordered the two cheating fishermen to spend the next 10 days in jail. But prosecutors say the stain of their crimes will likely last a lifetime. 36-year-old Chase Kamensky and 43-year-old Jacob Runyon are in court to learn the price they will pay for crimes they committed to win a fishing tournament. Oh! Runyon and Kamensky stood to win more than $28,000 at the tournament in Cleveland last fall. But organizers discovered that they added weight to their catch by stuffing the walleye with lead sinkers and fillets. Quite frankly, they, the, the fish that they weighed didn't pass the eye test, and I knew in my gut that I needed to do something. It's just what we do. Winners win. In March, Jake Runyon and Chase Kamensky pleaded guilty to one count each of cheating and unlawful ownership of wild animals. Although they were only charged with cheating at the Cleveland tournament, other fishermen were suspicious because the two men dominated Lake Erie fishing in recent years by winning a total of nine events. That this may have not been the first time. Also, the fishermen and the anglers believed that. They believed that in their heart. After the cheating scandal came to light, the $100,000 boat the two men used in the Cleveland tournament was seized by authorities. Prosecutors told the judge that investigators found a hidden compartment on the boat that smelled fishy. That would have enabled these defendants to conceal whether it be fish that they caught the day before or the lead weights that would allow them to potentially pass a boat inspection. I wish I could take it back. It's embarrassing. Shame. Most eager decision I've ever made in my life. On Thursday, Chase Kamensky and Jacob Runyon apologized for their crimes. At the end of the day, you're convicted felons and cheaters. Judge Stephen Gall then sentenced them to 10 days in jail and ordered them to pay $2,500 in fines. Prosecutors say Chase Kamensky and Jacob Runyon have become the poster fishermen for bad behavior. What we saw here was a, a couple guys who are now the Pete Rose of fishing, you know, and their conduct was far worse. We had individuals who blatantly cheated and committed a fraud upon all the other anglers who put their money and time into these competitions. And even though their fishing licenses have been suspended for the next three years, investigators say it's likely Chase Kamensky and Jacob Runyon will never be allowed to compete in a fishing tournament ever again. Nicole? Thank you, Jeff. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.